trip today. I had to pack some bento boxes. Lunch got Wagyu and fish in Yakura. The only country where you can just get a Wagyu in a bento box. And it'll be some of the best Wagyu you had anywhere. That's so deliciously melty. Some pickled veggies. To add a little crunch. I don't think I've had a single bad Wagyu beef bento box. This next one, roasted salmon on top of minced salmon on top of salmon eggs. Mm. This might be better than a Wagyu box. You really don't need to chew it. Wow, salmon belly so it's the fattiest part of the salmon. It completely evaporates in your mouth. They add on those the popping the cura and the super soft minced salmon as well. This might be one of the best bento boxes I've ever had. This is ridiculously good. A little crunchy veggie for a texture contrast. Wow. And it looks so beautiful too, just glistening in the light. It's just a box of edible glistening stuff. Anyway, this trip is going to be really, really interesting. Heading to Takasaki today, so it's about an hour from Tokyo, for an all-you-can-eat buffet. Not just any all-you-can-eat buffet. A free all-you-can-eat buffet. I'll explain more when we get there. Welcome to Takasaki. Really a tiny little town. That's about a 20 minute walk to the buffet. Or a taxi, but I think we're walking. Whoa, that is just a tree full of persimmon. That's beautiful. I've never seen kiwi tree before. There it is. So they build this as an amusement park as well. Um, what this is actually, it's a konjac jelly factory. If you guys don't know what konjac is, it's this plant and you can make all sorts of stuff from it, like noodles or snacks. It's got a very crunchy texture, it's delicious and zero calories. So this factory just makes all sorts of konjac products and every day they have an all-you-can-eat konjac buffet and they show you how the konjac products are made. And as I'm finding out right now, it's like an amusement park, look at this. They got little bunnies and I guess that little guy is like a rectangle konjac. This is supposed to be something that's really cool. Um, this is a foot bath. This apparently is like, like a highlight of this place. They call it the ocean blue bath. The key right now is trying to find this all you can eat buffet. So all these are konjac products like konjac jelly, konjac cakes, noodles, gummies, and there it is, the free buffet. So it looks like there's a lot of space for stuff there. I don't think there's anything there. All the stuff is over here.
this is just the coolest thing. First of all, I love konjac. It's a must have ingredient for a hot pot. So if you've seen my past hot pot videos, I always eat konjac jelly. And it's so versatile. Like I said, look at this. You can make it into noodles, into cakes. You can stir fry it, boil it, grill it. Konjac ramen. Mmm. That's so good. Konjac's texture is just one of my favorite things. It's so crunchy and snappy usually. It tastes like a very snappy vermicelli. Mmm. I mean, it's so satisfying. And this one, they put in the shoyu broth. That is now a delicious bowl of ramen noodles. Some chilies make this even better, but it's free. I'm not complaining. Mmm. That is so slip worthy. Wow. The broth is good. The noodles are good. I'll be honest. That was way better than I expected. <laughs> as much as I love konjac, I'm really interested to see what they come up with. This is like a konjac skewer. So this thing is way snappier than the ramen. So whole chunks of konjac gets way snappier. Mm. I already love the konjac texture. The sauce is a little sweet, sesame. It's so snappy and good. This one, look at this, looks like a giant um, scallop and they give you mustard to put on top of this. This is my favorite one. Again, I was kind of skeptical because I never had konjac with just spicy mustard before, but this is very clear sinuses kind of spicy mustard. And this thing, you did with the konjac is ridiculous. This thing just tastes like a really snappy piece of jelly. It's really hard to describe the consistency of konjac. It's very much a unique texture and flavor. I did not know how well this worked with spicy mustard though. Like I said, that's my favorite one. This is a pan fried konjac, no sauce attached to it. Mmm. Actually, this is my favorite one. Oh. This is excellent. That contract's a little charred on one side and the sauce really just got steeped into it. Sweet and snappy, a little bit of char. This is crazy looking, I've never seen this before. Konjac tempura. I love this. Luckily, I, I, I saved a little of the ramen broth. Dip this into that ramen broth. Mm. That's such a great way to eat this. Tempura goes really well with ramen. This obviously has been outside the fryer for a little bit, so the outside is not as crunchy, but still a little bit of subtle crunch. You dip it in that ramen broth, let the batter soak it all up. This tastes just like any other tempura. That's awesome. This is uh, stir-fried konjac jelly noodles with, I think, some tofu. Mmm. Tastes like a marinated lo mein. And then there's these little fried ones. My texture is so crazy. It's almost like eating a uh, radish jerky. These you gotta chew a lot. They definitely don't break down that easy. I like it though. It's also a little cold marinated konjac. And these noodles I cook with some tofu skin. Mm. This is a spicy konjac. So far, I tried all the savory konjac dishes. I mean, I knew konjac could be really versatile. I didn't know you could make it into so many different types of products. I certainly didn't know it tastes really good with spicy mustard. I think most of the savory item I had are really good. I think this is stuff we can actually bring back to the US, so I'll definitely get some of this, some of the ramen, I think these marinated noodles, and for a free all-you-can-eat buffet, you can't beat that. Oh, it's also a dessert section. Be right back. So there's about eight dessert items. By the way, uh, the menu changes every single day. Look at this, dessert konjac noodles. All right, that tastes more like a, like a salad noodle than dessert noodle, because I think there's a little bit more of a savory element to this. Definitely tastes more like a soy sauce, vinegar, marinated cold noodle. 
So I think that section may be not entirely everything is dessert. I think there's some parts that are just cold appetizers. Mm -hmm. There's some of this konjac is mixed with um, sesame oil. This I don't like. I need some veggies in there mixed into the konjac. Vegetarian Slimer. This one, switch to the spoons. Mm. Konjac jelly, it's hot for flavor. Oh, I love this. This one, the texture is not gonna be snappy at all. Oh, it just tastes like jello. Like really soft jello. Oh, that's so good. And this last one, this just tastes like creamy, creamy pudding. It's creamy, it's so soft. It just tastes like regular pudding. Again, zero calories. Well, with the sauce, I'm sure there's more calories, but Conjac itself, no calories. Extremely healthy for you, tons of fiber. Conjac dessert is something I always buy at grocery stores. I don't think I've ever had a Conjac pudding before. Mm, that's definitely my favorite dessert here. The reason why they had that buffet, obviously, is promote their products so you can come in, try out the different Conjac items, take some stuff home. It's also so fun to try all these different variations of Conjac. And I'm just wondering, if you live in this town, why don't you just come here every single day? <laughs> like I would. The products that are for sale are really affordable. Also, they have on the buffet exactly what products you're eating, the calorie. It's pretty filling. I'm good. I'm satisfied. And this will probably be the only buffet I ever go to in my life where I probably ate under, I don't know, 500 calories. All right, eat up, go buy some stuff. So this is under a dollar for a giant bag of this stuff. Oh my gosh, these snacks are 100 yen, so about 60 cents. I'm getting a grape one and a peach one. These are the little contract squeeze strings. These are delicious as well. All about three bucks. Conjac dumplings. Conjac popsicles. The ramen that I like. There's so much good stuff here. Ooh, this is Conjac liquor. Definitely getting some Conjac noodles. Slurp delicious and no calorie. Upstairs they have massage chairs. A little arcade. And this is where the conjac is made. Look at all these foot saunas. <sighs> Sit here and eat my grape ice cream. It's like a chili popsicle. That's good. It's definitely very konjac -y. So to get out here, it's a trek. It took about um, two and a half hours for us. From Tokyo, gotta take the Shinkansen, then take a local train, and then walk here. Or you can take a cab from here to the Shinkansen station. Either way, come out here, enjoy a free buffet, get yourself some konjac.